Takwat's Peak, pronounced, sometimes, is a granite, 8,846 foot tall, 2,696 m, rock formation located on the high western slope of the San Jacinto Mountain Range in Riverside County, Southern California, United States, above the mountain town of Idlewild. Takwat's has a steep approach hike, approximately 800 foot elevation gained in a half mile, leading to a roughly 1,000 foot face. Takwat's, which can refer to both the rock outcrop and the outcrop's parent peak, is a popular hiking destination to the fire lookout station and the rock climbing area. The Yosemite Decimal System, widely used in North America to classify hiking and climbing routes, was developed into its modern form at Takwat's Peak. Takwat's Peak can be reached from one of several trails and is only a half-mile deviation from the Pacific Crest Trail. The most direct route is the South Ridge Trail starting in Idlewild, California. This trail is a direct hike to the peak and is typically used as an out-and-back route, four miles in length, featuring a 2,400 feet elevation gain. Takwitz Peak can also be achieved via Devil's Slight Trail in Idlewild, 4.8 miles one way, with a 2,350 feet elevation gain. The peak can be reached from the Pond Springs Aerial Tramway via a 10-mile hike with rolling hills and various ascents and descents. Takwitz Peak is used as a fire lookout in the late spring to mid-fall, using a two-man ranger station with 270-degree panoramic views. The area was named after the legendary luminous spirit demon of the Soboba Indian tribe. The name first appeared in print on a 1901 USGS San Jacinto topographical map. Point two nearby rock climbing locations are Takwoods Rock and Suicide Rock. Lily Rock, originally named Takwoods Rock, and still known by that name by mountain climbers, is one and a half miles, 2.4 kilometers, to the southwest of Takwoods Peak. The rock is said to have a lily white appearance, which might account for the second name. Another theory is that it was named for Lily Eastman, who was the daughter of Dr. Sanford Eastman the first secretary and a director of the Southern California Colony Association which later became Riverside. Suicide Rock is 1.6 miles, 2.6 kilometers, to the northwest. Over 300 climbing routes have been described. In 2018, the Cranston Fire burned up the south face of Takwoods Peak and threatened the fire lookout. In the 1930s, the Rock Climbing Section, RCS, of the Sierra Club members in California started a campaign to identify potential rock climbing locations in Southern California. RCS member Jim Smith discovered Takwitz in June 1935. The first fifth class ascent of Takwitz, the trough, class 5.4, occurred in August 1936 by Jim Smith, Bob Brinton, and Zine Jassaitis. A month later, Smith and Bill Rice quickly put up the now classic route, Angel's Fright, 5.6. In 1937, Dick Jones and Glenn Dawson led a first ascent of the Mechanics Route, one of the first 5.8s in the country. During the late 1930s, the movie Three on a Rope featured climbing at Talkwoods. By 1940, about a dozen routes had been established. World War II slowed down development, but activity soon picked back up and fresh faces were seen at Talkwoods. Royal Robbins, a prominent member of the RCS, led the new surge in Talkwoods development in the 1950s. This new group of climbers eschewed some of the time-honored safety techniques of the past, which led to harder and harder climbs being developed, culminating with the Vampire in 1959. Though Robbins and Dave Rara climbed it via aid technique, 5.9A3-4, it was free climbed in 1973, 5.11A, by John Long ETAL and is now considered one of the best free climbs in Southern California. With the help of new climbing shoe designs, Route development in the 1960s jumped well into 5.10 territory. Nearby Suicide Rock also started to be developed, resulting in another Southern California classic, Valhalla, 5.11a, in November 1970. The Yosemite Decimal System, YDS, of classifying routes was developed at Talkwoods by members of the RCS of the Angeles chapter of the Sierra Club in the 1950s. Royal Robbins in 1952 established what was then one of the hardest free climbs in the United States, known as Open Book. As new routes were constantly being discovered and climbed, the old method of rating climbs as either easy, moderate, or hard was quickly becoming useless. With the help of fellow RCS members Don Wilson and Chuck Wiltz, the modern system of rating fifth-class climbing was developed, with the scale running from 5.0 to 5.9. Mark Powell, a local who frequented Yosemite, passed this system on to the climbers in Yosemite. 
By the early 1960s, the Yosemite Decimal System was the standard in the United States. In 1967, Bob Camps and Mark Powell established Chingadera, one of the first 5.11 in the country, and setting a new standard in rock climbing. Most climbers, after the 1970s, considered the area climbed out in terms of potential new first ascents. Still, new and quality climbs continued to be added on Tokwigs as well as the smaller rock outcrops nearby, Bob Gaines having established many of them. The Idlewild Area Historical Society Museum contains a wealth of information about the early climbing history of Tokwigs and Suicide Rock. The plant Ivesia colita is endemic to the San Jacinto range and is known by the common name Tokwitz mousetail.